Welcome to Daddy Realtor's Home Edu Series. Today, we have with us the female terminator, Ms. Wada Sharif, who is the Managing Director of 18 Pest Control. Wada is licensed to kill all household pests, except human ones. And we would like to find out more about how to keep our homes pest-free. Perhaps uh, let's start off with our first question. What's the number one pest issue in residential flats like HDBs and condos? And what would you advise homeowners about it? Basically, a lot of uh, requests for what I realised, a lot of uh, for apartments and HDB, they, their first number one pest is uh, book lice. Surprisingly, um, book lice, but uh, it doesn't have to involve chemical treatment for book lice. But um, the reason why there's a lot of book lice nowadays is because the structure of the house um, doesn't permit too much sunlight to come in. Mm. So, um, and because of that, it's like a chain reaction where you have book lice and eventually you have moles, mm -hmm. fungus, mm -hmm. and it will also lead to probable termites attack. Yeah. Uh, so, the solution for this is actually quite simple. Mm -hmm. As a homeowner, they should just um, air the house as much as possible, get fresh sunlight to come in mm -hmm. and uh, when it's not permissible, they should actually get a dehumidifier to mm -hmm. circulate the air. Mm -hmm. So I think that is the basic thing that the homeowner should actually just take care of. So no treatment necessary? No treatment at just all. Just change the conditions? Yes, that's right. Oh, wow, cool. Yeah. Okay then, so, um, second question I have in mind is especially for landed owners, mm -hmm. whether there's a difference between landed and flats uh, and then what sort of pest issue for landed then? homeowners can do. Okay. For landed, it's a total different ball game for its mm. own because um, their you know, ground units, uh, uh, houses, they have always a problem of rats coming in, mm. um, cockroaches, and this has be is because that uh, number one, for cockroaches, they have uh, sewer chambers inside mm. the house, and uh, for rats, normally it's uh, from the drains in the garden areas mm. where it's from the neighbouring side that will come in. Uh, so my recommendation actually um, for landed properties is that they should actually encourage to have a maintenance, a pest control maintenance on a regular basis, uh, maybe like every two months or three months. Um, and that will also involve uh, people checking up their roofs also because sometimes um, homeowners don't really check the roofs so they don't know what's actually above in their attic yeah. so the pest control will normally check the roofs to make sure that it's all in prim and proper and um, you know avoid termites activities mm. okay. so yeah. really prevention is better that's than right. cure that's right oh, okay. thank you very much uh, miss wada um, for sharing these valuable tips for, uh, with homeowners um, so that they can really keep their place pest free so uh, that's two minutes with uh, 18 pest control and here's a uh, daddy router signing off.